the best way I can help now is if I step aside and let government get back to governing. We're sitting by for Governor Cuomo's press conference, his daily briefing. How would you contrast Cuomo and President Trump's handling of the crisis? Truth versus mendacity. Governor Cuomo um, out there day after day after day, everything Trump isn't, honest, direct, brave. Real leadership of the kind the President of the United States should have provided. Governor Cuomo is clearly living in a totally different reality, the actual one. Governor Cuomo has become a national leader. Governor Cuomo, no. I think, is, is, is one of the heroes on, on the front lines. With all of this adulation that you're getting for doing your job, are you thinking about running for president? You guys are the social media savvy ones. Have you helped your dad with his dating life? Gotten online for him? Set up a profile and anything like that? Andrew Cuomo is getting a lot of good press right now, and there, that is the pinnacle for Donald Trump in any situation. Good press. Yeah, I'm sure he watches those uh, uh, the Governor Cuomo's briefings, which, uh, which are carried live uh, by and large. You spoke to National Guard troops today in a stirring speech that, if I wasn't listening carefully, I thought you would send soldiers off to war. These interviews and pieces of evidence reveal a deeply disturbing yet clear picture. Governor Cuomo sexually harassed current and former state employees in violation of both federal and state laws. Cuomo continues to deny that he intentionally did anything wrong. Investigators allege he sexually harassed 11 women, many of them young, and retaliated against at least one staffer who came forward. Now, the accusations include unwelcome and non-consensual touching, offensive remarks, and sexual comments. Look what these women went through. They were put through hell by a very powerful man, 11 women, including a state trooper, harassed, in some cases assaulted, and he thought he could get away with it. Is there anything you can tell me about this investigation? Anything more? Senate lawyer, Christine. She belongs to Roth. So you don't. You're nothing to me now. You're not a brother. You're not a friend. I don't want to know you or what you do. I don't want to see you at the hotels. I don't want you near my house. When you see our mother, I want to know a day in advance so I won't be there. 